here. The army has uh, basically declared this area, as you can see behind me, a barricaded area and declared it a military zone. They're not allowing anyone inside, even though we have seen some uh, some members of the families, dozens of uh, families uh, who are barricaded inside this building come in and out of the building. It has been a very tense situations, uh, situation here in Hebron. Palestinians say that these families here, the settlers, have no right to be inside, that they have not purchased this house legally at all, that they have, uh, they're the only one who could sell the house and they have not sold it to anyone. We have, we are seeing some uh, advocates here, we're seeing some uh, some foreigners who are normally here in, in, in Hebron uh, uh, recording and uh, in solidarity with the Palestinians. Uh, nevertheless, there is an increased uh, increased uh, presence of, uh, of uh, uh, army here and security here. In fact, President Mahmoud Abbas yesterday did speak on the matter. Let's have a listen to what he had to say. The bottom line is that if things do not get back to the way they were before July 14th, there will not be any changes. All the new Israeli measures put in place since that date until today must be removed so things can go back to normal in Jerusalem.